day 23, you guys, and today we are looking at a Ruobos tea, I believe. Because for day 23, we are looking at Alpine Punch. Now, let's see what Alpine Punch packs. Now, it is a Ruobos, as I was uh, stating earlier. It has Ruobos, coconut rasps, apple pieces, cinnamon, ginger pieces, natural and artificial vanilla flavoring, cardamom, black pepper, rose blossoms, and almond flakes. Now, this is an interesting set of ingredients, and I think, for what it's worth, it's going to have a nutty, yet, at the same time, little spiciness to it. And maybe floral aromas. Now, I'm waiting to see how this tastes. I know I've had this before, but it's been so long that I am very, very intrigued. So, let's see. just as I thought. So this is definitely a tea that it's oddly sweet in the terms of like you definitely taste the apple, you definitely taste uh, rose blossoms, it has like a floriness to it but a floral nuttiness and it definitely feels like a campfire tea in a weird way. Like it feels like an out in the cabin on a cold snowy day type of tea. Um, and I'm not complaining, this is good. It's low caffeine, so it's, or no caffeine for that matter. So you can have it at any parts of your day. And it's tasty. I think you guys would like Alpine Punch. That's day 23, tomorrow we hit our finale of 24 days of tea, and maybe for a little while I'll give this voice a little bit of a rest. Um, but, I do like this. I do think this is a relaxing tea. Especially after the stressful days that we have, we always need that one tea that's just perfect to unwind to. And Alpine Punch, I think, might be that, guys. So if you've had Alpine Punch, leave your thoughts down in the comment section below. As always, thank you for watching. Like, share, and subscribe. Until next time, I will catch you later. See ya. Bye.